Following the opposition-controlled National Assembly's approval of contentious bills yesterday, including the Pure Labor Yellow Envelope Bill, unionized workers will hold a mass rally this Saturday to demand its swift implementation. In the meantime, the nation's prime minister calls the passage regrettable. Yi Shihu reports. Around 140-thousand unionized workers are expected to come out to the streets this Saturday to demand the swift promulgation and implementation of the so-called Yellow Envelope Bill approved by the opposition-controlled National Assembly on Thursday. The members of the Federation of Korean Trade Unions and the Korean Confederation of Trade Unions will come from around the country to gather in Seoul to hold separate demonstrations. They're demanding President Yoon Song yeol to not exercise his right to veto the Democratic Party-led revision to the Trade Union and Labor Relations Adjustment Act approved by the opposition at the Assembly following the ruling People Power Party's walkout. The revision guarantees bargaining rights for indirectly employed workers and prohibits damaged lawsuits being brought against striking workers. Prime Minister Han duk -soo said on Friday that the unilateral passing of contentious bills is regrettable. It is really frustrating and regrettable that agendas that deepen social conflict that are far from the people's livelihoods are handled without sufficient deliberation. This is unfortunate. The government will collect opinions from all walks of life on the problems and side effects of the bill passed this time and examine in depth the direction for the national interest. Prime Minister Han further called for the Assembly's support in helping the administration focus on an agenda that deals with the people's livelihoods. Amid the possibility of a presidential veto of the Yellow Envelope Bill, Chief Presidential Secretary Kim Dae-gi said the legislation hasn't yet been transferred to the administration. When this happens, it will consider many opinions, Kim said, responding to DP's related question at the Assembly on Friday. The PPP said on Friday that it will suggest a presidential veto. Lee Si-hoo, Arirang News.